Welcome back again to Zenith Kodam TV. In this video, we will be going over the highlights of the grand final matchup between Stalwart vs Elevate in the Snapdragon Asia Pacific Challenge. So without any further ado, let's jump straight into the action. Amazing job. Asti also had a really good run as well at the slums. And then we're moving into the turn. I didn't get to see it because we're getting to the game straight away already. Not to worry, you'll get to see the map pool after that. But right back into game here for the match number one of our grand final is going to be Star Wars Esport right. versus Elevate. Let's go. Quick goes up hand to hand if it's even needed at all, but it's not needed to get those early kills. They already can't get control of the point here. Off, break kills comes in from the side of Elevate Incendio from backside, but Shut Up comes in for the backup. What about Halo? Clears it up. Looks like the control points going down to now. He denied instantly with Incendio as well as with Grenade by Skirt coming through. Cliff shuts him down immediately. Breaks of the hill has been done. And now they just need that 20 points to actually catch up and they might, might be low to the side. What had they were able to do with Vault? Can they do it again with Star Wars as well? Just cut all this oak here. He's going to be able to get this heal, but then again, it was back to elevate again. And right here, they break the heal for the half time at the moment. Right now, clears out one FBX and they spotted out another one. He's by Clov just in the nick of time, but in the mean, but in the meantime, uh, PG for the defense wise, Clov doesn't spot out. He's right now, so as Star Wars, these re enter the point here, but it's not going to be too easy. Elevate already surrounding just in the nick of time. In the meantime, FDS keeps control over the door, keeps over control. Doing well for the first match, and this they have to win that P3 first of all. They need to try to make sure he claims it for Star Wars Esports first. They need to be able to, but he does not do it too well. Now the equalizer coming out, gets a double kill, Ooh, right? Kill. No, he didn't get the kill. Oh, no, that was just such a raid for the domination side. Put it out one inside the mana. Here. Now it's going to be PJ to try to hold his own here. No. He gets the first kill now. Can he hold up a second time? Star Wars no. a little bit too far away. Another point, it goes through. And Elevate takes the first point now in this best of, well, seven. But it is still going to be a point that's map away from them. Definitely. I mean, there were a certain time that we do see that uh, P3 wasn't even able to be break by Elevate. And they were struggling to go in. But early rotation... After having just lost that first round, they're certainly going to be hurting the momentum somewhat in the beginning here. But... I'm confident that they will somehow figure out a way here. And this is where the threat is going to be very, very... For elevate. Agree, definitely. I mean, STA versus BSW right here at the slum, they managed to shut down even three. So this is something that I think STE will do the same. Star Wars Esports gets the information. They're going to go in for the dash. They're going to move fight. Sticking him out now. Leaving the team of STE trying to defuse the bomb. But Susano makes it done. Make it one point goes out. See how Skirt does it. PJ will oh, be no. able to get... Element surprise as well. Hey, no, he does easy no, PJ. No, PJ no, is not... He doesn't no, realize where he is. Oh, no. turns around just in time. My goodness. No. Shut up. Spotted out from that glimpse and managed to quick scope to make the crucial... Oh, no. Oh, he was going to be backstabbed by Susano. He takes down Yopi and then Susano finished the job. Elevate doesn't do something right this instant. I see can punish the Luffy now leaving. Oh, right backside. That's going to be FDX who gets the backstab. Yeah, it's two. Can't quite get their way towards A, but now they will be able to try to take full strength here. They will be able to get the defuse anyway, keeping Elevate Ooh, out of the point. 15 seconds. Is it going to be enough? Down Yopi right there. He will try to do oh. quick scope. Nice in for the rush. He spotted up PJ trying to do the melee. I mean, all the bodies putting, throwing it, getting the fuse done in time, but will they be able to get in time? Not quite shut up, gets it just Ooh, in the nick of time. To equalize the number, Yopi takes down all right at the baseline. He will be able to take down Kalo as he dropped the bomb. But here, FDX prepared. Can he survive it out? Nope. Skirt's not going to allow it. I mean, DRH. Waiting for anyone to just try, try to come his way. Kalo comes Ooh, through and nice. will get taken down. Shut up. Goes for another one there. Kisano is the last one standing hey. and will get taken down by a sniping hey. shot from FDX. Drop. FDX is right at the peak. Susano, they back away from a fight. Shots coming through from Yopi to shut down. He sent one more play to go, and Yopi mm. takes down Clove. Oof, I mean, a bit hard pill to swallow there for Star Wars, especially Lost having taken that lead. Instantly, and now leaving. Oh, mm. he said you managed to do a One more to go. He takes nice. down Yopi, coming in, but now from the left side, he has to prepare. He's putting him out, and Skirt makes a change. Skirt <laughs> takes down Kalo. Really on to elevate. This is not looking good for their oh. side. They're down to two, and down to one now with Luffy. He only has a sniper rifle. He spot someone, no. he gets the kill done. And this is going to be a perfect setup, but can he hold oh. on? No, he does not. FDX oh. with the backstab keeps it a two. Two point lead and wins this map here for Style War Esports Challenge. Looking at the stats right now, we got Luffy with 10 kills. I mean, compared to yes, and destroy. Now, moving into control, this is it. Raid Star Wars Esports versus Elevate. We're looking for the best. 
position while Star Wars Esports get themselves set up and ready to try to invade a complex, get one kill, get two kills. Waiting for the right time. He's hard blind with a wow! Side right this listen and they gotta reposition themselves again with number stacks slowly cautiously going in. Oh right, the OPC shut up, he's gonna try to backstab them. He actually does the kill done. So he's gonna go straight into the gun side, goes with a slide, doesn't quite get the shot done. Incendio shuts them down. Balance between the two. Like we've seen time and time again when teams just can't go out by PJ, but PJ just barely misses him out, gets a spray. Supposed to do just now recently, but now they're with their self trying to stack it off the Rob because they what? want to backstab a clown over his PJ comes in with the analytic. Can he get it done? He gets one though, and now he goes in with FBX. He gets two. Oh no, he actually missed it out. It was oh. him, out, but no, he finishes off anyway. Our second match point of control. Yeah, nine lives here. The back door gets a double ooh, kill there. Ooh. And the rest of East STE goes in for the kill. They swoop in there. Three, Heimer already two, running out there. One, they no. will not get it in time, though. So Style Ward continues. Defended. B will not be allowed by the team of ST, but Incendio. Still coming through onto Star Wars Esports though as Elevate tries to go for that mid. On the other note, he's in for the back step, takes down Susano, nicely done in left. Burn out Elevate straight away to the spawn side. Takes down PJ, takes down Susano. A little bit overextension right there. Can he actually do so? He already prepared with the equalizer. Now, two people still remaining, maybe even one left, but then we managed to get at least one word in edgewise. There's still nine lives left, and now it's on Star Wars side. So it's a very impossible task here no. for Susano, and indeed he gets taken down. Now by Incendio in order to allow uh, to allow Star Wars Esports to just take this 3-0. Effectively, I mean, certainly that gives a huge a tactical advantage for Star Wars Esports. This is very tricky, especially the fact that we've already seen Hardpoint Hacienda, where the team was just back and forth, seesaw, everybody was just coming in on the early games, but then as it goes into the mid-game, the team of Star Wars Esports at East Esports was actually losing some of the momentum, but let's see how they do here for the hard point summit Stall on Esport versus it. Well, the added grenade looks so close, uh, too close for comfort, but it's still the sprays coming through the smoke is going to work out. So hard point still been grounded by the team of Elevate. This is just like the repeat a deja vu has happened on the first hard point. United as well, and this thing is di still back and forth from the side of Elevate versus ST. Kills done for the side of Stall Ward Esports. Elevate, in the meantime, still struggling to try to get to keep this point. So at least they're able to do that right now. Ooh. Now Kalo comes in with the equalizer spots. One, Club FBX looking for the to be break just one more he breaks one he breaks two he doesn't actually manage to control that second one he's trying to spray that break the hill again giving the points back to the team of ST but still they need to do more claw in the hands gonna spread the wings of that claw straight away to the entrance spot it on PJ as well getting two piece gonna look for the rest so almost immediately after getting that one kill nice. Luffy continues to try to win quite Ooh. yet and elevates getting just countered at every turn oh, another oh, perfect oh, coming oh, out oh, this time oh. from Sasano's side getting a lot of kills done from his end he also takes the points now in order to not even the odds here if he got the deficit of 30 points here while FDX tried to hold his body. Oh, early rotation. Early rotation is what is doing well. FDX with a two piece for that for this match, and this is going to be three. Just over 50 points away. Equals are coming out now for Clovey and able to get this here. Star Wars Esports regrouping around the northern side. It is all they need to win it here. Luffy coming oh, around the side gets caught oh. out by the war machine. He's still trying to spot for anyone else. PJ gets taken no. down as well. And takes left here for Star Wars Esports to take this map down. Push into that P2. Right, this is an elevator. is already stacked up with three players. Oh, that so far. But 10 points still remaining. Sparrow is already coming true here for Shut Up. He's clearing things out here. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh. Trying to break through the defense here. But the defense is coming Six, home seven, here. Just seven, enough more. Just eight, a little bit more. Nine, they they just still have to hang oh, on for dear life here, 15. and they do get it in the end! And we have our Champions of Challenge Finals, Star Wars Esports! Being off with 1 minute 27 with 198 impact, and we have Skirt Whereas, Report. Uh, it seems like Star Wars Esports, they will be the representative for Asia, Pacific, and Japan going to the finals of the world. Uh, what's it called?